netting and setting an I.O. module. You can add a device to channel by two ways. The first one is to use library of devices. You can choose and add the device from the list. You have to set correct address of the device in the device properties. The autogen of variables is turned off if you're in full mode. If you want to create the variables, you can select one or multiple data points or even the whole device or channel and turn the autogen on. The second option how you can add a device to channel is to use auto detection of devices. Check the channel setup and deploy the solution to the PLC. Choose the commissioning mode as a run mode for PLC. The PLC will act as some sort of converter and you'll be able to detect communicate with the devices on its business. Click on channel and choose Domet module auto detect and choose the range of addresses. Devices will be detected and you should be able to see the results. You can change address or baud rate of the selected device in this window. The module needs to be restarted after changing the baud rate or address. Once the device is restarted, you can detect the devices once more to check the change of address on the module. To import the device to channel, select the option Import and click on OK button. If you want to use, for example, temperature sensor PT1000 on analog input 1 AI1, you have to change parameters of this input. Default setting is to measure voltage 0 to 10 volts. You can read either the PT1000 temperature or, as in this case, measure the resistance in range 0 to 1600 ohm. You then have to select transformation to transform the resistance to temperature. Resistance to temperature. Then, choose sensor type PT1000 and change the pre-K parameter to 0.1. Resistance 0 to 1600 ohm is measured on range 0 to 16,000 points. Therefore, we need to shift the decimal point to left. Turn on the autogen for this data point. As the PLC is still on commissioning mode, you can upload the configuration of the AI to the input-output module. Select the option Domat Configure Module to configure the device. Deploy the modified solution to the PLC and select Full Run. Start the debugging and check the variable you created. It should show the real measured temperature from PT1000 sensor.